Oke, okay, bismillah. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello guys, welcome back with me. So, in this video or in this other video uh, on or in this other uh, what how to say? Uh, tutorial. Uh, so, in this uh, video I will tell you uh, about how to fix black screen in your laptop. So, Uh, maybe we know ya, we know about black screen in our laptop because sometimes or when we get crash or others, so we can get black screen, right? So <clears throat> uh, if you know black screen is, uh, we can fix it. So in this, in this, uh, how to say dunia? I forget. In this dunia, we Now in this uh, era maybe and also in this era we can search in YouTube in Google and we can search or we can ask uh, your parents your friends and others so let's move to uh, next slide so in this slide I also uh, make video about IT solvency problem my English SKL next so what is the black screen of date the black screen of date is a critical system error that causes your computer screen to display all black the, the system error force your operating system to shut down because it can no longer safely safely function the black screen of date can be caused by several factors including hardware or software issues or mar malware you can get a blank or black computer screen on startup while updating software or in the middle of device usage sometimes you can resolve a black screen on windows 10 or windows 11 by rebooting your device but in serious cases you may need to perform a system restore Or reinstall operating system. So black screen, black screen. You can see here malware. So we we should uh, we should uh, double check yes, double check or we uh, or we never and ever to download crack because some crack is have malware or we can say virus, right? So. Black screen also can in Windows 10 or uh, 11 uh, or Windows 11. Yes, because this is Windows. If you uh, not want to black screen, I think MacBook cannot black screen, bro. Next. So, first I want to tell you about how to fix black screen on Windows 10. Yes, because uh, if you don't, if you if your computer is Windows 10, uh, so this is uh, some quick ways to fix a black screen on Windows 10. First, use the keyboard shortcut Windows key, Windows key, uh, or plus P, or CTRL plus ALT plus DEL to reset reset the screen's graphics system. If the issue causing your Windows 10 black screen is a simple one, a keyboard shortcut can help solve it. The second is hold down the power button for 10 until 15 seconds to the hard reset on your laptop or PC and reboot your computer. If your computer wanna reboot and display a black screen again, see the section below on fixing a black screen before me. So Here we can we can see Windows key, uh, Windows key, uh, how to, Windows key or cetera alt del. Uh, I don't know if the uh, why the recording is stop, but if if can you can see, I will give you this. Thing. Nah, like this, bro. If like this, nah, in here like that. So next again. So 
this is for the Windows 11 like I say in uh, last last uh, last slide yes uh, Windows 10 and 11 is same the cases if if here uh, if you can see uh, if the oh, oh, oh. Oh, where, where, where? Yeah, I think it's not uh, very case. The cases is not difficult, right? Okay, similar to Windows 10, like I said, you can use a keyboard shortcut Windows Windows logo key plus P or Ctrl plus Alt plus Del to wake up your Windows 11 screen or hold the power button for. 10 until 15 seconds to reboot your device completely. If this solution don't work, don't worry. We will guide you through the necessary step to diagnose and fix the issues causing the black screen of it both before logging and after. So I'm sorry if the slide is not good. Uh, no, no. The word is... Uh, word, the word is... Oh. Not... Not... Yeah, like that. So next to the next slide, I come now. Oh, yeah. 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 Okay, sorry guys. So here, if you see this <laughs> this word, because I'm uh, see from here. Yes, yes. Uh, like I say, we can see in the Google, YouTube, or others. So let's move to the uh, slide next. Yeah. Solution for a black screen before logging in. A black screen before you in the login screen appears is usually easy to fix. You will just need to target the actual cause of your particular black screen issue. Next, first, uh, first solution: optimize your startup application. If your PC or laptop display a black screen or Startup. Try disabling some startup apps to optimize your boot. Uh, this is application. Avigi turn up lets you turn off all non-essential application and put them to sleep automatically. It's built-in sleep mode features. Boot feature help you get the most out of your RAM and CPU power, so you have the resource you need at startup. Next, select the second solution. Uh, second solution is check your cables and connection. If your PC or laptop display a black screen on startup, try disabling some startup apps to optimize the boot. Eh, where was? Sorry, yes. Oh, I'm not changing this. So here, here. Ah, if you uh, otherwise fully con constraining Windows device suddenly display a black screen. Check your computer cables connected to your computer, your monitor. There could be an issue with the connection or the actual cables. So like this, unplug and reconnect your video cables. Disconnect and reconnect all of your video cables, HDMI, DVI, Display Port, and VGA. Try blowing uh, get into the port to clear and dusty and dust. The two enders or other debris that might be uh, interfering with the connection. Okay, the second is create a different cable. Uh, contently unplugging and plugging in cables causes that to wear out over time, and eventually they break, especially if you use a laptop with an external monitor. 
uh, if you know about the laptop, they have second monitor like um, Asus Asus ZenBook Pro Duo OLED. Uh. So like this, if the laptop have two layer, two two monitor, we should try a different cable to check with whether whether your cable is close in the black screen. Try plugging in a different video cable that you know work, like the one of the one like the one from your TV. If you get an image instead of a blank screen with that cable connection, it's time to get a new computer cable. So, uh, if you uh, like, we if you have a tap C cable, you can try this. Try a different monitor. Uh, okay, next. Unplug all unnecessary accessories. External hard drivers, USB connection, Wi-Fi antennas, VR headset, and other accessories can cause cause issues. During boot, if your computer screen is black on startup, unplug everything that's not essential for your PC to work. Leave only your monitor, mouse, and keyboard plugged in, and restart your computer. If you suspect it's a hard drive issue, you can check for signs of hard drive failure and use CHKDE as a command to fix hard disk issue on a bigger desktop computer. Try me from. Removing all unnecessary components like sound card and extra RAM or random or random access memory fix if you still see nothing on your screen after startup. Switch out of the graphic card and update the RAM completely. So CHK the DSK. Okay. Uh, next I again because I only have time. Try a BIOS or UV reset and check the re the boot order. BIOS and UV are crucial program that manage essential hardware configuration and ensure the proper launch of your operation system. BIOS is commonly used in older PCs. PCs, while UV runs on newer models. If you are getting a black screen of that, try re reverting to the default setting. Here. How to reset BIOS or UEFI? First is turn off your PC, then hit the power button to turn it back on. Back, back on. Immediately during startup, you will get a prompt to hit a certain key to enter setup. Usually uh, F2 or the Dell key. Hit that key rapidly. So, uh, this this BIOS uh, I have. Some problem when uh, I think in junior high school maybe. So if you uh, if you BIOS or what or before you uh, enter the starting page yeah starting page like you should Windows Windows L yeah Windows L uh, before oh no 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 before the screen is your uh, apa your laptop merek merek Yes, like Lenovo, Asus, or others. Yes, press F F2 or the Dell key before that. Next, five. Launch a Windows repair. If your PC goes to black screen and you still see nothing, try launching a Windows repair, which is a set of tools and diagnostic utilities built directly into the operation system. Next, oh here. Oh, see. Uh, back to this. Yeah, uh, I will tell you. Set to default setting. Find an entry that says load default or optimize default or something similar. Depending on your device build, BIOS or UEFI looks different, but the general wording of the entry should be similar. Selecting this option, reset everything back to default setting like this. Make sure your PC boots from its hard disk. Uh, you can see. Next. Okay. Reset your PC several times. Doing this repeatedly will launch the Windows startup automatically. 
repair screen. Click Start if it doesn't fix the black screen issue. Repeat this step and select it as this advanced option. See, yeah, okay. Hmm, you can see this. Okay. Next is boot into save mode. Windows Save Mode launches your PC with the minimum drivers and programs running, which may help you avoid a black screen at startup. Save Mode means only Windows launches, eliminating any interference from an unnecessary program or drivers. Nah, next aja. Okay, kita, we next. Seven is rollback or update all driver in Save Mode. As mentioned above, a faulty device driver can cause an unbootable system. To fix this, you install any device driver that could be not a problem. Could be a problem. Okay, yes, see, see, see. This time, click start up thing. If you don't see that op option, click see more recovery option. Then click start up setting. Okay, start. Press five. Okay, like this. Okay, like this. Next uh, aja. Okay. Right click Windows Start at selected Device Manager. Like this guys. Device Manager. Okay. We next go to the problem. Uh, usually driver like this where or sound video or sound and game controls. Double click the entry, such as NVIDIA GeForce GTX. That uh, then go to the driver tab, or back driver click this. Yes, okay. We next again. Okay, we next after logging. In. If you get a black screen after entering your password and logging in, you can still find the source of the issue using one of the solution below. Okay, if uh, if like this. When you enter the password, if the if the black screen after that, we can see. Disable, disable all automatic application. If you see a black screen after logging on a Windows 10 or 11 or Windows 11 device, something is affecting your operating system, your OS, while it's trying to load your desktop and icons. Usually, it's an app that's loading automatically. Uh, press ctrl uh, plus alt plus del select task manager if the black screen in, uh, in, in task manager go to start up and disable every item reboot your computer and check if everything not works normally okay next start explorer exe the program explorer.exe windows explorer is responsible responsible for loading for your desktop and icon if the program isn't loading after login then with this explorer is more to functioning and all you will see is a black screen with a floating cursor or logo see press CRT alt that select task manager or help theater l shift escape File, run news. File, where is this? What is bro? This is Windows 10, bro. I don't know. I click file. What is file? This is service details. Users, startup, story, performance, process. Nika. Oh, yes, yes. Explorer.exe Explorer.exe Enter Ah, the tip Okay, your desktop should not appear Now that you got your desktop back, you will need to get Windows Explorer loading automatically and log in to do, to do so, edit the windows I guess the heart of the windows. Oh. Uh, 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 okay, 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 okay. Hmm. Okay, windows again. 
install a new graphic driver if you get frequent and seemingly random just black screen issues your graphic driver could be the reason make sure to update all md intel and nvidia drivers security so that your graphic card will properly check out your detailed instruction how and on how to update your graphic drivers and our guide to monitoring so mm, you know if your laptop has AMD or NVIDIA or Intel, we have uh, how to say uh, application ya yeah. application from the the driver ya yeah. like I use uh, NVIDIA GeForce NVIDIA so NVIDIA NVIDIA ah, GeForce experiment or NVIDIA experiment so don't forget to switch between screens if your PC is connected to multiple monitors or even a uh, VR headset with windows in the PC you can accidentally switch your output to the screen that's off when you see a blank screen hold down the windows key on your keyboard on press P this also your display mode option and allows to my pitch okay guys enjoy why does my screen keep going black Your screen keep going back due to a critical error in your computer operating system. Like faulty device driver or hardware detect, a Windows software glitch, or even malware will usually fixable. Finding the root causes, cause and of the black screen isn't always easy. Here are some common causes of a Windows 10 or Windows 11 black screen. A Windows update gone wrong. A faulty startup application, deleted or faulty drivers, connection issues. Software or hardware defect, defect ya. Yeah. Problem with your graphic card, loose cables connected to your PC. Next, nice. performance user. You may also run into black screen. This is when you are trying to get the most of uh, the most out of your screen system for gaming or research intensive tasks like video editing, overclocking, help optimize PC performance. But it could lead to overheating and GPU issues, possibly leading to the black screen update. If you want to boost your PC performance while avoiding a black screen, learn how to. Okay. Okay, maybe that's all from me and in that's all for this video. Thank you for watching this video. Okay, semua. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.